Hey, you guys, I want to talk about this lawsuit against Google. I think it's ridiculous. I think that if Google is doing well and people are choosing Google, because I do, I have a choice, but I choose Google every time because to me, it's just, I don't know, I guess, first of all, I like the way it looks. It's kind of clean and bubbly and bright. I like the white background and then the bright colors and they, they always have like some kind of, you know, daily, you know, teaches you something, right? I just, I just like the, the way it's put together and I also like to search, um, you know, everything. I just prefer Google, I personally. For example, I used to go to Walmart for grocery shopping because that's where I could get most of my things for cheap you know, even organic stuff. And then whenever I couldn't find something, then I would go to the other grocery stores. But to me, it was like a one-stop place where you can do, you know, your other, you know, toiletries and even clothing, you know, for the same reason. I mean, they were the competition to Kmart, right? A few years ago. And eventually, Walmart got better and better and they just like, you know, took over. And people were upset that Walmart was taking over the mom and pop shops. And I can totally understand. I can totally understand the mom and pop shops suing Walmart for monopolizing, but not the government. You know, the, the thing is, I wish that our government would fight, you know, would sue, you know, these, these agencies that take kids without court order. That's what I wish that our government would do. I mean, that would just make more sense. Oh, but never mind. They are a government agency. So the government cannot sue a government agency. I, I wonder who makes money when the government <laughs> sues Google. You know, who makes that money? Oh, the attorneys. But I'm wondering why there aren't more attorneys suing DHR for taking kids without court order. I want to know. But anyway, that's my thought for today.